I visited Bangalore in nineteen seventy three. What a city it was! Bangalore had several green parks all over the city. The city was cool as there were many beautiful parks with lots of greenery, like Lal Bagh Garden. The roads and streets were flanked by trees. But today, when I read the news about Bangalore, I got shock of my life. I could not believe it. I thought that is was fake news. But the source of the report is from the Indian Institute of Science. Scientists of the Indian Institute of Science said that a surf water crisis has arisen in Bangalore due to urbanization without plans. It got a very drastic change from the year 1973 2023 This issue is explained by the Bangalore Urban Information System and Bangalore Lakes Information System It gives a comprehensive overview of Bangalore's urban dynamic ecological sensitivity Bangalore once upon time it was the garden city of India also known as the city of lakes now It has become the IT capital of India but the green gardens and blue lakes have disappeared a huge construction took place in a very short period of time leading to water scarcity pollution of land air and water traffic congestion etc greenery has fallen to 3% in 2023 while Built up area increased to 87 percent. In 1973, the greenery was 68 percent, and built up area was just 7 percent. Bangalore has only one tree per seven people. That is, one is to seven. Bangalore greenery turned into concrete jungle in the name of development. A large number of trees. have been cut and tall buildings have been built the ground water table has gone down and down more than 7000 bore wells have dried up in bangalore alone to tackle the water crisis the karnataka government banned the usage of drinking water for various purposes including washing of cars gardening entertainment construction and maintenance violating this order can result in a fine of rupees 5000 this story of other cities of india is also similar what do you think is the solution what we need to do make our cities livable please write in the comments